over marijuana use in Texas is taking center stage tonight in Fort Worth. This as lawmakers decide whether to make changes to our state's medical marijuana laws. Yona Gavino, live in downtown Fort Worth with our top story at 10. Yona, what are you learning? Matt, there appeared to be overwhelming support today at this event. Only a handful of protesters at an otherwise peaceful march. Free the weed! Supporters marched today, rallying for marijuana reform. Free the weed! Event coordinator Cameron Pinkerton says he wants sensible regulation, not over regulation. So we're not having to get our medicine from the streets, and so that we're not throwing veterans in cages. We're trying to access a plant that grows from the soil they fought to keep free. Despite its murky legal status, vendors promoted marijuana products and CBD oil. Scott Lube talked about its benefits for people in need of pain relief. Anti-inflammatories, uh, antidepressants for like PTSD and soldiers, um, MS, Crohn's. Uh, we see it for hyperactivity. We see it using it in pets. If HB 1365 becomes law, it would expand that list of qualifying conditions, so more people with debilitating conditions would be allowed to access low THC cannabis. The bill would allow patients with more than a dozen conditions, including cancer, autism, and Alzheimer's, to take part in the state's compassionate use program. It's something supporters today are in favor of. There's so many people that need that and need it to be legalized because there's so many arrests and people getting in trouble for it. Minor things. It's not just a bunch of hippies and a bunch of stoners sitting around all day long. It's people that actually need this stuff. It's medicine. The next stop for this bill is the Texas Senate. Live in Fort Worth, Yona Govino, CBS 11 News.